We're here for tonight's post-game press conference with head coach Dan Munson and student-athlete Tobias Rodicard. We'll start with an opening statement from coach Dan Munson and open it up for questions. When you're ready, coach. Well, I'm really proud of, of my guys. That was, that was a, you know, uh, to, to be a good team, you got to win in different ways. And, uh, you know, we, we tried outscoring people early in the year and it didn't work. And, and fortunately it worked today, but, you know, we didn't really have a choice. Uh, you know, uh, this it's February and, 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 uh, we got a lot of guys banged up and so do a lot of other teams, but our guys didn't use it as an excuse today. And I was, you know, we're down to eight guys. And as I told the team, you know, that's less than half our team. We started the year with 17 and played today with eight and, uh, and the eight, uh, uh, just did a great job. You know, as I told them at practice today, you know, four, four of those guys have, have carried us all year. They've, they've started and been a load. It's going to be these other four to come in and, and just be solid and just do their jobs. And I really thought they won the game for us. You know, I mean, obviously, you know, the, the numbers, uh, but, but Joel Murray's going to score for us and Colin's going to score for us. And, and, uh, uh, Kadir and and, and Jadon are you know got got roles on the team, but for for Tobias to, to, to get his first start and 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 be such a a, a factor offensively and, and rebounding the ball was, was huge. You know he's you know he's playing out of position. Eddie Scott comes in and playing out of position and 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 played you know his role and did his job. Uh, AJ Neal gave us solid minutes out there, and and obviously Jeffrey Yan, you know, was probably the worst team in the league for him to have to try to come guard, and he did a great job. You know, I mean, there's nobody really out there for, you know, they don't have a center either. So, in that regard, it was nice for us to have this game. You know, I mean, Saturday will be a lot different uh, with Irvine having the best inside game in, in the league probably, but. You know, uh, we'll worry about that on Saturday. Today, I was really uh, pleased with our guys and, and finding a way to, to win. It was a very dangerous game, trap game, whatever you want to say for us. And, and our guys went out, went out and, and, and did their did their jobs. Coach, was it a little bit of the uh, game plan to kind of play a little bit more loose tonight, maybe specifically in the transition? Not at all. <laughs> I mean, we were just trying to. You know, again, we, we've always pushed the ball, but but you put another guard out there, and it really spread the court. I mean, Tobias, uh, you know, in there, and 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 Kadir, we signed as a guard. I mean, you know, he's a wing, you know, his whole career. So, uh, you know, we have five guards out there. Obviously, we knew it was going to spread the court, but we said we didn't want to settle for threes, and we wanted, you know, to get the ball inside. And we, had, but we had forty-four points in the paint, so it wasn't like it was just threes. But you know, uh, uh, I thought our guys offensively. You know, we, we didn't have a turnover in the second half till the last five minutes. And uh, it was about by far our best assist game. But And it helps when shots are going in and guys getting a flow. But we needed that because offensively, they just – or defensively, we just got riddled. I mean, you, you know that's how they play. You know they're going to take 30, 40 threes. And uh, we just we – were, we, were, we didn't anticipate it as good as we did at their place. And, and they really made us pay. Uh, Tobias, what was your mindset going into the game, knowing you were going to get the start and, and, and a chance to play a lot tonight? Um, I, I got into the game just focusing on my role, just playing out of position as a four. Uh, just played a little bit before, but really focusing on rebounding for us because we only have Kadir really as a as a main big. Uh, and then in offense, just moving the ball, playing off those other guys, Joel and, and Colin, and just hitting open shots. Hey, Coach. Um, it seemed like in the first half it was back and forth, and in the second half you opened up on a 12-0 run. Um, what made the difference there? And also just what's going through your mind when you're seeing like most every shot going in in the second half before a stretch there? Uh, it, it's a good feeling when it's shots are going in. I mean, it masks a lot of problems. Uh, but but we came out, and, and I, think we, I think we started with uh, five straight stops. You know, and again... Uh, if we can, if we can, if we can, if we can get stops and rebounds, we're a, we're a hard team to defend because you know if we can score, get out in the open floor. But you know if you're taking it out of the net like we were the first half, you know it's it's not quite as effective. And so, you know we we only had we call them kills three stops in a row. We only had one kill the first half, and uh, and we we had two we had two kills in, in in the first four minutes of the second half. So we took control from the defensive end, even though shots were going in. Um, Coach, the team was able to get a lot of experience tonight as uh, Big West tournaments coming up. Um, I'm just curious, you know, seeing how the team played, especially in the second half, how good does that feel for you? 
Well, it feels good. I mean, you know, obviously we got to get some guys back. I mean, we're it's not smoke and mirrors right now. It was great those kids came in and responded, but but you know, we're 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 hopeful to get some guys back because you know this is when we we didn't. Jeffrey Yan was the only guy you know that that's ever played inside in their career before this year started. That played today. So the other seven guys, you know, um, are, are are you know three or four of them are trying to play out of position. So. Uh, and, and we've been out of position all year. I mean, Jordan Roberts has been our five that came here and started as a freshman at the three and, and all that. So we're, we're kind of used to it, but uh, uh, we know that when three games in, in two weeks from now, you know, we got to get some guys healthy and, and get back to, to a little bit of the rotation that we had when, when we were winning uh, the, the, league, the meat of the league season. Okay. And Tobias, um, you know, you got the start tonight. 17 points, career high. How does that make you feel? Uh, it feels good. Definitely boosts my confidence. Uh, started the year kind of uh, kind of bad shooting wise. A lot of games where I get two shots, miss both. Um, feels good to kind of get the rhythm from the start and and just made it easier for me. Coach, do you have any update on the Ed's injuries? Starting with uh, Traore. Uh, you know, I, I, no, I mean, I'm not the trainer and, and there's just too many of them right now. We're, we're nicked up. Um, you know, the, the only one I know for sure is, is Joe. I mean, Joe's, Joe's, you know, uh, wrist has got a fracture in it. And so he's, he's out for the year, but the rest of them, you know, all have a, a chance to come back at some point, but I have no idea when that is. And we can't, as a coach, you just got to plan on, these eight guys again on Saturday, and if somebody, sh you know, shows up in a, 